Hello guys, and welcome to my first ever Let's Play on the channel. I'm going to be doing Luigi's Mansion, one of my favorite games out there. And uh, I actually have quite a history with this game, which I'm sure I'll get into at one point or another. So let's just, let's just start it up. This is my uh, test save file that I haven't finished yet. This is a friend's save file. I know he watches my videos and he's going to be like, what the hell, he still has this? And uh, this is the uh, one we're going to be playing on. So yeah, the options over here. This guy, you'll you'll like him. Trust me, if you're if you don't know about this game. But yeah, here we go. It's not so nice, nice looking as it is on the map, now is it? And here we are in the mansion. Or the foyer, the foyer room in the mansion. Yep, you could use the control stick to move around, you could uh, use the small light, uh, I guess the small light stick is a uh, control stick, but yeah, use that to move the flashlight. Uh, you can't jump or anything, you could hold B down to uh, turn the flashlight off and, uh, and like flicker it. Plus, what you can't jump, but you can do this with A. Okay, it didn't work that time. There it is. Okay. So yeah, pretty standard stuff, I guess. This is a launch title on the GameCube, and uh, yeah, it shows off all its technical capabilities and stuff with the shadows. See, um, if I position it, yeah, you can see like on the base there. That was like some really cool shit back in two thousand one. I still think it looks cool today. So what you're supposed to do is supposed to go up here. And that's triggered something. So then you're supposed to go back down. Okay, something I just noticed. I don't know if you noticed it, but when the ghost uh, went by these candles, it turned them off. If you see this one's on, this one's off. I actually just noticed that. And so does that one. A wise man once said, shiny is good. Enjoy this key cutscene because I'm not. A, I'm gonna skip all the other ones. Take a lot of knocks in this line of work. I'm getting too old for those ghost Captain Tom Fools. Anyway, nice to meet you. I'm Professor Egad. The 
ghost house. I swear, it seems to have more ghosts every day. Once again, probably what you do around here, right? Uh oh, this looks up. Alright, young sir, look up, look lively. Follow me. Post haste! So, your name's Luigi? I think our paths were destined to cross. Well met, Luigi. Mm hmm? Where is this, you ask? Well, this is my cozy quarters where I do all, all my ghost studies. I am Professor Egad's ghost research laboratory. A lab, if you're on the short name, not. Yeah, if, if you're wondering what this little crack shack was, uh, the crack shack in the beginning cutscene is actually where we are now. It's just uh, inside there's like this little elevator that leads underground. That's how I always thought it was. Uh, you won this mansion in a contest you didn't even enter? Sounds pretty fishy to me. So you believe this mansion actually exists then? Right. I've been living here since I was about a twenty or so, and I'll tell you, that mansion appeared just a few days ago. Spirits are full of you. I don't know if it's a dream, an illusion, or a one all, but I surely wouldn't be happy about winning a haunted house. Now that I get a look at you, I just recall. A guy with a red hat, kind of like yours, went into the mansion without even stopping to check. And he never returned. Is he a dream too? What? Like always a brother? Oh no, that's horrible. I'm going to stand a chance against that ghost again. Help. You have to go after him. Here's the plan. I'll teach you to deal with ghosts so you can rescue your brother, Luigi. Alright, uh, this is the, um, uh, menu screen, it's all the stuff on it. It's actually an easter egg, where if you wait on here long enough, you'll get a certain song, but I'm not gonna do that, because it's real late at night, and my parents can probably hear me talking right now, it's probably bugging hell on them, so I'm just gonna skip it. That's the vacuum cleaner I engineered to catch ghosts. I call it, this is genius. The Poltergust 3000! It could suck up all kinds of things, what a river. Use the R button to vacuum and the C stick to change your direction. Like this. No matter how strong you think your brother is, ghosts aren't mysterious beings. They can't be caught using conventional means. So you better use this, it's the only way to fight them. This is the only thing they fear. Or something to that. <clears throat> now, how about, how about we start your training? First, you need to like the dark, and they avoid the light. So if you hit them with your flashlight beam all of a sudden, you can stun them momentarily. And then it's vacuum time. Then, when you see your chance, hold down the R button and tilt the control stick in the opposite direction. Give it a try. You'll learn more of it that way than just looking at me yap about it. Alright. As soon as you see a ghost heart, that's your chance to vacuum them up. I'll vacuum and tilt the control stick in the opposite direction to bring them in. Do that. And you just pull away in the opposite direction, and you come. I have two. Here's a new little thing. Okay. I tend to get the other one. <laughs> and I think next is all of them. That's why we're having last place. Alright, this is all of them. Got three. Go get those ghouls, Luigi. I'd say you're ready to rescue your brother now. Oh, oh, I see. Fine, fine. Looks like you worked with Craig's up there. How about a little cool down in the gallery? I'm quite proud of it, you know. Uh, I'm gonna go to the gallery in case you guys don't know what it is. Yep. Oh, oh I, I see. Well, that's slowly. Um, this is the gallery. Yeah, if you want to see it, this is EGAD's lab. Uh, over there on the left is uh, a room we haven't seen yet. Bottom 
on the bottom there is uh, uh, the training room. And uh, yeah, here's the gallery. You can press A up to one of these and it reveals one. You can also go into one of these doors. In here is the shiny gold room. By the way, it'll go in there. It's been a while since I played this. Oh, there's a button. Okay. Alright. Oh, we got. I have 21 paintings in my famous ghost collection. Now the enemy's friend. What a crime machine. Unfortunately, there are only statues here now. You feel free to look around anyway. Use the X-Men to strip your surroundings of that Game Boy horror I gave you. You hear the sus suspicious voice of Max Robot. You also check objects by using the A button to tap and shake stuff. Don't try that on those angel statues. <laughs> yeah, you know, he hints to something being up with the angel statues. Like maybe they're like weeping angels or something. Or no, they just do this. Yeah, no, not, not nearly as cool. Statue very tall. Angel statue right up to this. Yeah. Yeah, you can be a lot cooler if Luigi went up against weeping angels from Doctor Who. Uh, I'm gonna go back to the lab. Alright, I'm gonna go to the main here. He doesn't have eyes. On his model, at least. 